Hey guys, Mr. Tempo Speedy here, and today we're going to be playing part two of Pikmin 3 for the Wii U. So in the previous episode we played days 1 and 2 which included the tutorial part and we managed to rescue Brittany and now we're going to go and see what a signal was that we found towards the end of last episode. Hopefully we can find some more fruit as well to fill up our juice stand. Quickly collect these. A few extra Pikmin, then we'll start getting some Pikmin out of the pod as well. Okay, let's see. I think we can get all of them out, really. Yeah, basically, so we'll take a hundred. Obviously, we can come back and get some more or swap some if we need them. Slightly overthrew him, so right, they're going to take them back. Um, where was we going? Was it all this way? Just looking down on the map, so we'll pick these guys up again. Now give us a few more in there, in the little pod of the rock Pikmin, which we don't have many of at all compared to the reds. Right, so we're going to throw Brittany across here. Throw some Pikmin over to her. That should be enough. Because from our end, we can't build this bridge, so... We'll get her to build the bridge, and then we'll get some of these guys to start on this. Break through and go into... See what this signal is. No, we're still looking for Charlie. I think Charlie's the other guy, so. We'll find him eventually. Hmm. Oh, there's some fish from there. Let me switch to Alf and send some rock Pikmin over. open as well so um we'll quickly go and investigate with these 35 Pikmin and we'll let Alf catch up. Another day to file. Let's see. It's tough to say how many days I've been on this planet. I hope everyone back on Hokatati, maybe? I can't remember how to say that. Um, it's doing well. I'll have to smuggle back some treasure in my pocket to give to my son as a souvenir, Captain Olimar. So if you played the previous two games, then you'll know who that guy is. Yeah. 
quickly catch up with these guys now. And that's all 100 Pikmin. We're only a quarter of the way through the day. Let's investigate what's in this cave. big guy. So we're actually going to need to use some rock pigment. To injure him. Because his armor can't be hurt. By the red pigment. So we probably could have done with some more rock pigment on this part to be fair. This was all we really had at the time, so we'll still be able to do it, it's just it might take a little bit longer. Gather them all back up. Where's he gone? Now we can get some of these red guys to try and attack him as well in the little exposed areas. That's most of his armor done now, so we should be able to just hit him on the head. Oh, anywhere really. And finish him off quite fast. surviving. As soon as he drops back down we'll be able to get him. Where's he gone? You gonna drop here? Yep. And there he goes. It's a nice piece of fruit and a massive phone. Can you get a phone? Old phone. So let's get these guys to take all this back for analysis. Send them guys to take him back. Um, Obviously that's what we already learnt through that battle. Don't think we see another one of them now, so that's alright. 
take all this back to the drake and see what we can do with it. And we still have half of the day left, so let's see what else is around. I don't think there's much that we can explore at this moment with what we have. Obviously we can't go in the water. Well characters can go in water but the Pikmin can't at the moment. We need some different type of Pikmin for that. Uh, is there anything under here? Nope. That we can't get past, that was just electric ears. Um, what else can we look at while we're waiting? It's going to be quite a slow day for this rest of this part now. There's another. Grab this. It can't jump when it's weighed by Pikmin. That's why it tends to shake them off. So there's some bricks there which suggest we can probably build a bridge somewhere. Oh, there's actually another piece of fruit. So we're going to need Elf to come around and help. These guys are still carrying all those around. Four and a half cups at the moment, so hopefully we'll be able to get up to about six cups at least. Um, shouldn't take more than seven to hold that. what the drake says. I think this is about the phone. Yeah. An ancient communications device used on this planet. It contains technology unknown to Kopai and is emitting a signal even now. I'll have health look at it tonight to see if we have any use for it. Might have a few ideas with his engineer, engineer's expertise. It's so, alright then, it'll be useful for something. There's another piece of fruit. So we can't get over here. No, I don't think I can send Elf over there. So. We'll come back out of here for now. Hmm. Quickly have a look on the map. So that's an unexplored area over there. That we can't get to. Um, I think the rest are just blocked. That's where we was in the last episode when we walked around and found the rock pick pin and Brittany. No, we don't want to go there. Um, that's where we've just been. Yeah, I think that's all the exploration that we can do on this part at the moment. And then we'll just see if we can find some ways of making some more
Pikmin. What have we got at the moment? If we put all these in. Okay, so we might need some more red Pikmin now. Wait for these guys to bring this back and then we'll see what we can go and find. Day's gone a bit fast. Although there isn't much to do now, so. Let's see if we can hit this. There we go. Get out, stay here. I don't really think there's much point in going too far now. Because we'd have to bring back whatever we pick up as well. Um, oh, this. Yeah, sweet there. So you guys can take that together. Um, I don't think there's anything up here. No. Yeah, that's about it. I think really. We haven't done too bad, we've got two pieces of fruit, uh, defeated that monster, found that phone, and we've gained a few Pikmin. We've almost got 100 rock Pikmin now. So next time, depending on what happens with that phone, we'll either end up going to a new area, or we'll find a way of getting some more red pigment. Depends on what happens. Run around, wait for this countdown. <laughs> and that's it for the day. Let's see how much juice we get out of those two pieces of fruit. That's two of them. Fire breathing piece. So that was like half filled up. There's another one. Oh, we got a full. That's two and a half. That's a good seven that we got out of that now. Can we get nine? I think we'll only get one out of this actually. Maybe one and a half. It's one. Yeah, one and a half. That's alright though, we've got a few of these now, so we're quite stocked up. We got seven, which is quite good. So even if we don't find fruit for a few days now, nah, we'll be fine. Lost a few Pikmin to that monster, but we found a few things in the process, so we're doing well so far. We recovered the communications device that was inside the armored Mordat. 
According to ALF, this device contains part that may expand the Drake's communication range. I've never seen him so excited. He can't tear himself away from the thing. I'm more happy to write today's report while ALF examines the device. Sometimes he can be so diligent. And that was Brittany's little monologue for day three. So that's been part two of the little playthrough for Pikmin 3 guys. Hope you enjoyed it, uh, have a nice day and I'll see you in the next video, goodbye.